in this video we are going to talk about what is respiration and blood pressure so come to the respiration what is respiration definition of respiration respiration is the act of breathing it composes of two processes that is inspiration and expiration so from this respiration is the process or action of breathing and it composite of two process that is inspiration and expiration both of these com both of these form respiration so inspiration is inhale and expiration is exhale so respiration may be it may be external or it may be internal so external respiration is the movement of air between environment and lungs and internal respiration is the movement of oxygen between hemoglobin and cells so there is two types of respiration one is external and another one is internal from the term external it means the movement of air between the environment external environment to the lungs and internal respiration is the movement of oxygen between hemoglobin and the body cells so this so there are some events or series that take place in respiration while we are taking respiration there is series of events that take place so the events are first is breathing so breathing is moving the air into and out of the lungs so we all know breathing is the movement of air into the lungs and out from the lungs then come to the next step that is external respiration here exchanging of gases between the air in the lungs and the blood so in external respiration the movement or exchanging of gases oxygen and carbon dioxide these gases are exchanging between air in the lungs and the blood after that the next event is gas transport so gas transport by blood where transport of oxygen to the body cells and the return of carbon dioxide so in gas transport by blood in in this event here transport of oxygen to the body cells and return of the deoxy that is uh, carbon dioxide from the cells to the outer world mainly here the main event is take place that is from the external environment the oxygen is goes to the body goes to the lungs from there it goes to the body cells and from the cells the carbon dioxide is exhaled out or returned from, uh, from the cells to the outer world so mainly in gas transport the oxygen and uh, the carbon dioxide are changed or exchanged from the body cells then the next step that is internal respiration in internal respiration here exchanging of gases between the blood and the body cells the next step that is last step that is cellular respiration in cellular respiration here using the oxygen in cell processes and the production of carbon dioxide so here in last step here the oxygen is cell is used in the cell processes and cells are used oxygen in their uh, cell processes and by the metabolism the carbon dioxide are produced by the cells this is the last step of respiration that is cellular respiration the normal respiration rate is in uh, adult that is range is 16 to 20 breaths per minute so now come to the factors that affect the respiration so there are various types of factors that increases the respiration that is exercise acute pain which i previously told in my uh, vital sense first part video 
where I told in uh, pulse or in temperature there is the factors that affect the temperature and pulse there is near about the same factors that is pain exercise anxiety long-term smoking which increases the respiration rate so next come to blood pressure so first come to the definition of blood pressure blood pressure is the force exerted on the walls of an artery by the pumping blood by each ventricular contraction so from the definition definition means that by each contraction of heart from the left ventricle the blood is pushed or pumped to the aorta so by the each contraction of our heart the left ventricle the blood up from the left ventricle it pushed or pumped to the aorta by this pumping blood to the aorta blood goes to the arteries of the whole body this blood creates the pressure on the walls of the artery so by the contraction of the left ventricle the blood goes to the by the forcefully contraction of the left ventricle the blood pushed forcefully pushed to the aorta to the whole body circulation whole arteries and in this artery this blood creates pressure on the walls of the arteries this is called blood pressure this pressure of the blood is called blood pressure so normal blood pressure uh, pressure in adult is ranges 120 to 120 systole and diastole is 80 120 by 80 mm of 80 so i told that there is two measurement systole and diastole 120 is the systole 80 is the diastole so what is systole so systolic pressure it is the pressure of which is measured when the left ventricle of the heart is contracting and pushing the blood into the arteries so systolic is the main part or vital event when our heart is contracting and from the left ventricle the huge amount of blood is forcefully pushed to the aorta this time the pressure of the blood to the arteries wall of the artery is measured which is which pressure is called systolic pressure the time when the heart is contracted and the left by the contraction of the heart the left ventricle contraction the blood pushes to the aorta the amount of blood is more in this time by the contraction of the heart from the left ventricle the amount of blood is more and the pressure of blood is more that's why systolic pressure is greater than the diastolic pressure so systolic pressure is measured when when the <coughs> sorry when the blood is contract when the heart is contracted the from the left ventricle the blood is pushed to the aorta this time the pressure of blood to the out to the arteries wall of the arteries is systolic pressure <clears throat> and the diast and the diastolic pressure it is the it is measured when the left ventricle of the heart is at resting condition means between two contraction diastolic pressure is measured between two contraction when the ventricle is in resting phase so there is some factors which affects the measurement of our blood pressure that that is same as previous that is exercise heavy strenuous exercise after heavy strenuous exercise the blood pressure is increases uh, age position of the person so those are the smoking any previous history of uh, heart disease or present of any systemic diseases so that factors may affect the blood pressure, normal measurement of blood pressure.